Night, night, night. We go night, night now. Night, night. <laughs> Sleep. Night. Please like, subscribe, and share. Cookie. Night. <laughs> I'm glad this night is going to be over with really soon. So here we go again. We are going to change lanes again a little bit. Uh, we kind of do this from time to time where we do some reaction videos uh, to, uh, to sort of break things up a little bit. Um, what, seeing your wife's ex-boyfriend? What is that one? Okay, so what we're going to do is uh, we're going to try uh, Nate Bargatze. He's a uh, stand-up comedian. He's from Nashville. And we're going to do a reaction video to Nate Bargatze on how to order Artis artisanal coffee. Okay. okay. Let's let's see what this is about. And I've only been drinking coffee for maybe four years. Not very long. I only order this one little drink. I get very nervous when I order coffee because it's a whole world and I don't know the world, you know. They always ask you a bunch of stuff. Like they're like, what kind of cream? I'm like, just please do it. Just do it. <laughs> you know? Sometimes they're like, do you want heavy cream or half and half? And I'll go, I'm sorry, I'm not taking questions right now. So <laughs> you, know, you could just do whatever you think it is. And if it's wrong, I won't even tell you. How about that? I will walk out of here as if that's exactly what I ordered. I will go outside, I will throw it away and go try again at a different Starbucks. That's how I'll handle the entire, that's why I think they have so many Starbucks. So you can just keep going. Someone's got to get it. If I have to get my wife's coffee, she has to text me what she wants because I don't know how to pronounce like most of the words there. So I just show them the phone. I go, she wants this. <laughs> and they're like, does she want it in Sweden? I'm like, guess we have to call her now, don't we? And I make them talk to her. I go, talk to a stranger's wife. Say what you said to me. <laughs> have you ever been to a Starbucks like inside? Like if you go inside and there's like a big long line and you'll be waiting, and they try to take your order before you're even to the front. Like, you'll be in the back, they're like, what do you want? You're like, oh, I would like to wait till I get right in front of you. <laughs> yeah, you know, when, you see how everybody looked at me when you said that? I didn't care for that. So, <laughs> how about we do it like a regular, normal business, you know? And you let me do it right in front of you. Starbucks is like waving cars down on the street. Just be like, we're just trying to get your order started in case you ever come here one day. Uh, <laughs> So I was in uh, San Francisco, and I bet there's a bunch of fun coffee places, and I live in my dumb world that just, I just want this one little drink. So I go in to a Starbucks, and I get in the front, and I was like, uh, I'll take an iced coffee with cream. She goes, with cream, I go with cream. And then she goes, iced coffee with cream, I go iced coffee with cream. She goes, with cream, I go with cream. And she said it one more time. She said, so iced coffee with cream. And at that point, I should have said, what's going on right now? <laughs> 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 Where are you at in your head? Because I, I feel like we're in two different places. <laughs> but I was nervous, and there was people behind me, and I was like, cream or no cream? Honestly, I'll give you $20 if you let me leave right now. I cannot, this is the most I can talk about this. I don't even know what's happening anymore. <laughs> <clears throat> so I paid, I go stand in line, you know, where you gotta wait for your drink. There's like five of us waiting for our drinks. So she puts the iced coffee up there first, no cream. And I was like, whatever. I'll just do it myself, you know? Like, I don't like doing it myself, but I was like, all right, I'll just do it. So before I could get it, she's walked back with a can of whipped cream and she's shaking it. <clears throat> and I'm just looking at it, like thinking that's someone else's. I'm like, someone's getting whipped cream. That's fun. <clears throat> One of you guys are getting whipped cream? And I look down and she starts spraying the whipped cream on top of my iced coffee. She just yells out, iced coffee whipped cream, yells it out. <clears throat> the other four people, they turn their back, like they don't want you to accidentally think that's what they ordered. <laughs> and I'm just left alone, like, that's what you thought I said over there? You don't think I would have said iced coffee with whipped cream? You think I'm just some nut job? <laughs> it's like, I've had too many problems in this Starbucks, so I'm only going to use the words that I want and no other words. <laughs> iced coffee, whipped cream, cup. And they didn't have a top for it, 
So whipped cream, it doesn't sink and become less embarrassing. It moves. It's like a buoy in an ocean that everybody sees. And I'm just walking through the crowd like, this is my favorite drink. I don't know if you guys drink this at all. Is anybody? Nobody does this? I'm surprised. And I walked outside and threw it away and tried again at a different Starbucks. Oh, that's great. So now you're not a coffee drinker. I'm not a coffee drinker. And our daughter I don't drink is obsessed with, obsessed with Starbucks. She's obsessed with Starbucks. She likes iced coffee. Starbucks. Yeah, I yeah. don't. I don't and, drink caffeine. And then there's some so. drink that's like dragon fruit or something. She knows when we go to Starbucks. She's she like. Did I'm I? like him. I don't know. No, I don't have a clue. I don't know. I just yeah. If I see something, but she knows exactly what she wants. Caramel mocha frappuccino with. Stardust and whatever. I'm right. Like, and like and then with a uh, pump of peach. Yeah. <laughs> I'm uh, like, how and, do you know how to order? I don't know. Like, and is they, there like they, some kind of class that you go to? I don't know. They, and, and like they the, the sizes, me, they're sir? all like Venti and yeah, like. I'm, well, I'm that's lost. French for large. Well, you, but, right. But I mean, it's but you just. <laughs> yeah, but they, but they asked me, you know, no, sir, what would you like? Uh, uh, I'll have that uh, uh, the lemon cake right there. <laughs> that's what I do. I do. Cake I get pop. the I get the lemon cake. The twelve dollars. Because I have no cake, idea. Yeah. And do you have anything that doesn't have caffeine in it? And they're like, uh, yeah. Well, well, what? Well, water. <laughs> we have. You know these assorted drinks up. I mean, I have no idea. Anything without caffeine? She knows. Yeah. I mean, she does she, her own as life young as she that, is, yeah. she knows her coffees and all that stuff. I have no idea what but, she's even doing, but I don't it's a treat thing for us. Like yeah. you know, and so, but I just, but, I'm like you. I'm like I don't, and I'm like him too. I, uh, yeah. Like I don't want. Um, and how do you say his name? Nate. Nate Bargatze. Bargatz- Is this another thing like the Chef Boyardi thing? Yeah. No, mean? it's not like the Chef Boyardi. <laughs> chef Boyardi. That's how it should be said. Boyardi. I know you. You. Yes. But Nate but, Bargatze. Yeah. Nate Bargatze. That was fun. That was a fun yeah, one. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah. All right. Anyway, uh, just shifting lanes a little bit. Uh, so hope you enjoyed the uh, the reaction video. We will catch you on the night on the next podcast. Please like night night. We go night night now. Night night. <laughs> Sleep night. Please like, subscribe, and share. Cookie night. <laughs> I'm glad this night is going to be over with really soon.